Good morning, y'all. Happy Thursday. This morning, we are headed out to hang out with our friends. So it should be a super fun day. It's a little bit of a drive, so we're headed out kind of early. This morning, I got my workout in, so I'm feeling pretty good. Like, I had the shower turned on. I was like, I'm not gonna work out. I'm just gonna get ready. And then I turned the shower off and I put my workout clothes on and I worked out and I'm so proud of that. <laughs> we are here. You've gotten so big. <laughs> Do you remember her? I am, I am, I am, I am, I am, Do you want to ask her where her bathroom is? Where's her bathroom? But, but baby, Maddie and Maddie is not here yet. Not yet? And no. <laughs> Cherokee, come here. Let her in, Go Go Come here, come here, come here. Hello. Hello. You won't get red. I'll see what we have. still not feeling well at all. She, um, I took her to the doctor the other day and she's struggling really bad with allergies right now. And they prescribed her some Claritin and it just, I don't know if it's the medicine that's making her act this way. She's not being bad, she just needs me and it's very clingy and just doesn't have a ton of energy. I feel so bad for her, but she still managed to have fun with her friends. And now we're gonna head home and I'm gonna make dinner and we're gonna see Daddy. It's about a two hour drive to get to Savannah's house. Um, so on the way there, I kinda listen to music, but on the way back, I listened to like three um, The Homemaking Foundations podcasts. And I just, I'm so glad that I chose to do that because it was just, really just what I needed to do and it's just really fueling and it's good information. It's a good way to spend time in the car. So I'm glad I did that. If you don't listen to podcasts then I completely, I don't know, you should at least try it because I enjoy it like when I'm, sometimes when I'm working out I listen to a podcast. Um, usually when I do laundry, but I'm one of those people like if I'm listening to something, something like that, like something informational, I and there can't be other in distractions like so I normally don't listen to podcasts while the babies are awake but they both slept the whole way home which was a huge awesome blessing and they got a little nap in so yeah they should be ready to play outside when we get home Deodorant. Oh my gosh! Because you'd be stinking. 
Because I'll be thinking. <gasps> that sounds lovely. My little friend sent me some deodorant. And a little letter. That is so sweet. Thank you. This is the one I wanted to try. Pineapple coconut. And I was like, oh man, that smells yummy. A memory I have growing up is I see a booty crack. <laughs> I see a little booty crack. Whenever we would go to my grandparents' house after dinner, we would always go for an evening walk. So I love evening walks. It reminds me of when me and like aunts and uncles and cousins and my grandparents would all just walk around their neighborhood after dinner and it just feels really good to walk after you eat dinner and we just ate dinner so <laughs> walking on the trail instead of the road per Cherokee's request like sounds like honeysuckle like the other day I passed by here I couldn't tell what it was there he is El Dorado you called my dad? yeah can't believe he's still alive Oh, <laughs> you can ride in the wagon, I'll pull you. Yeah. I'd love to pull you. Can you put that in your ear? No. Okay. No. Can you climb in? We need to teach Remington how to pull this wagon. <laughs> Could Remington pull 40 pounds of kids? Easily. Do that. <laughs> While Josh rakes the sand, I'm on El Dorado duty. Must keep him safe. Josh, look at Remington. Remy, yeah. stop it. <laughs> uh oh, they're <laughs> following suit. But Daddy just made that all straight. Oh dear. I need a massage here. Ew. Look, turn around, I'll do it for you. Where I was gonna die. You just put it on their back and you rub it around like that. Ooh. Well, good thing I didn't what are you doing? Where'd it go? It was more loud than I tried to. <laughs> Can you say more? Just more. Can we put it more. on your shoulder again? Sure. I thought it was a boy. And it's a girl. It's a girl? Oh gosh. Is that good? Bear, where's your eyes? Where's your eyes? No. Oh, no. Listen to me. Where are your eyes? Josh is helping his brother make a volcano. They come out that slow. Amazing. So after our walk, we went over to Josh's parents' house for a little while for him to help his little brother with his volcano for his school project. But that didn't last very long because Cherokee feels so bad still that we just came home because she's just tired and just she just feels really sick. And I don't know. I just feel really bad for her. And husband was reading her books before bed and she was literally falling asleep on his shoulder. That's that. But we're going to end the vlog here. Thank y'all so much for watching and we'll see y'all in our next vlog. Bye.